February 7, 2022, Venus, Mercury, and Mars shine in the southeast before sunup. Jupiter is low in the west-southwest and the moon is high in the sky after sundown. Chart Caption, 2022, February 7, three planets are in the southeastern sky before sunrise. By Jeffrey L. Hunt. Chicago, Illinois, sunrise, 6.56 a.m. CST, sunset, 5.14 p.m. CST. Check local sources for sunrise and sunset times for your location. Morning Sky Venus, Mercury, and Mars are low in the southeast before sunrise. The morning planet dance continues. Brilliant morning star Venus shines brightly from over 15 degrees up in the southeast at 45 minutes before sunrise. Through a spotting scope or telescope, the planet displays a morning crescent that is 21% illuminated. Venus is in its interval of greatest brightness. It won't shine any brighter during the rest of its morning appearance that runs until early autumn. Mercury is brightening each morning for the next several days. At this hour, it is over 5 degrees up in the east-southeast, over 13 degrees to the lower left of Venus. A binocular may be needed to initially spot it. The speedy planet bounces back and forth between the morning sky and evening sky. It reaches its greatest separation, elongation, from the sun on February 16. It then recedes into bright sunlight. Mars is moving eastward faster than Venus, after the brilliant planet resumed its eastward direction on January 30th. The red planet overtakes and passes Venus on February 16th. The conjunction is wide, 6.2 degrees. This morning, find Mars, 7.3 degrees to the lower right of Venus. Both may snugly fit into a binocular field. Evening Sky Chart Caption, 2022, February 7th, Jupiter is low in the west-southwest as night falls. After the sky darkens, Jupiter is that bright star, low in the west-southwest. It appears lower in the sky each evening. This evening at 45 minutes after sunset, the Jovian giant is under 9 degrees above the horizon. It sets 98 minutes after sundown. Jupiter is bright enough to be seen very close to the horizon, unlike Saturn. If you have a clear, unobstructed view toward the west-southwest horizon, you can watch Jupiter set in the same way you might watch a sunset. Chart Caption 2022, February 7, the Moon is near the stars of Aries and Cetus. The lunar orb is approaching the Taurus star clusters. At this hour, the Moon minus 44% illuminated, is over two-thirds of the way up above the south-southwest horizon. It is in front of dim stars of Aries. The brightest is about the brightness of the stars in the Big Dipper. Hamel, the full-grown lamb, is 12.5 degrees to the upper right of the Moon. The moon is bright enough to cast shadows and it may be necessary to block its glare with your hand to see the dimmer stars and the star clusters this evening. The lunar orb is at its first quarter phase tomorrow morning at 7.50 a.m. CST. Mankar, in Cetus, is over 11 degrees to the lower left of the lunar light. The star represents the nostril of the sea monster. This evening the Pleiades star cluster and Hyades star cluster are above the moon. The Hyades, along with Aldebaran, make the V of Taurus that outlines the bull's head. 